too hot for the ACG diet. Uh, so I have picked up some mushrooms. Okay, so I just want to do a little disclaimer first before I do this. Um, I'm rogue on this diet and plus I'm vegetarian. So the food choices that you would pick, I wouldn't. <laughs> I mean, well, you get what I'm saying. The food choices that I would pick for this diet, you wouldn't pick them because you would eat meat in replace of the things that I'm replacing. So, I'm eating mushrooms. I also have some, um, uh, what are these, Brussels sprouts. I have some apples. These are delicious apples. Okay, these are plums, but those are for my, my son. Um, this is the brand of uh, stevia that I use. It's called Pure. Uh, you can pick this up at Walmart. I also have some chili. This is chili paste. It's spicy. It's like um, Chinese. I wanted to give it a try in one of my um, one of my recipes that I'm gonna make. Um, a lot of my recipes are gonna be on my blog, so I'll take pictures and put them on a blog with the with the posts. Um, I have a uh, cabbage. Cabbage. I also have some baby spinach. And I just picked up the Just Egg. Um, I actually found it. <laughs> so I'm gonna try this out um, with some meals too. And actually, if you look at the calorie content, it actually has nothing in it. It has, it does have protein, but it has no carbs and it has no sugar, which is right up my alley for this diet. I have some green onions. I have some tomatoes. I also have some lettuce. Um, now, I'm going to be consuming vital wheat gluten. This is essentially my um, protein, one of my protein replacements. This and mushrooms. Well, I don't think mushrooms have protein in it, but I'm using it as a meat, a meat alternative. Um, I also have broccoli. I also picked this up. This is Walden's Farm, just to add some like flavor to the food because... I don't really like bland stuff, so I'm I'm gonna try this out and I'll tell you guys how it tastes. But um all Walden's farm well some of the Walden farm like I'll I'll show you an example. Okay, so this is good too. This is pancake syrup, it is the bomb, it is so yummy, so tasty, and you can have this because it's literally nothing in it. Nothing, no sugar, no carbs, no nothing. And it's, it's it tastes so good. Okay, so that's one thing. Okay, so I also have some Worcestershire sauce. And usually when I look for stuff like this, I make sure there's very little carbs in it and sugar. Like this has one gram of sugar, which is nothing. Um, so yeah, I have a red pepper. I also have some zucchini. I'm figuring out, trying to figure out a way to make zucchini fritters. Um, without gaining, <laughs> without gaining on a diet. I have some broccoli. I also have some unsweetened um, almond milk. And um, I usually put this in coffee and nothing else. Or I might maybe bake with it, like make pancakes. Well, usually if I'm on ACG, I rarely eat pancakes, it, unless it's like a protein pancake, but that's about it. I have a red onion. And I have two containers of strawberries. Now, I also picked up. This is the, this is my other meat choice. Now, I won't be eating too much of this. Just something quick. Like, I was planning on eating this and some broccoli today. But I don't. Like, the serving size is six strips, right? But I won't be eating six strips. I'll probably be eating three. With, um mostly broccoli and i also picked up the beef crumbles too i like these because they don't have soy in it you see that no soy for some reason i have like this reaction to soy so i stay away from, i try my best to stay away from products that have soy in it which is kind of hard but um i think that that's it that's my grocery haul for for the diet um, this is all the food that I picked up. I also have some other stuff in here too. Like some um I have some like lettuce packages and I keep a lot of green stuff in the refrigerator. 
so that I can eat it. Um, but yeah, but that's it. That that is the diet. This is what I'm consuming, and I'm gonna make some seitan tonight, and I'm gonna make a loaf of seitan, and I'm gonna break up. I'm gonna break it up into like um, what is that? Cause I I think the most I think I can have a hundred. 125 grams of seitan, but I'm not gonna have 175, 100, 125 grams. I'm gonna knock it down to 75. So what I would do is I would make a loaf of seitan out of this, um, use my scale to break it up into uh, pieces, or and then bag it and freeze it. And that's um, that'll be my protein source. And I also, oh, one more thing before I end this video. I also have Vega protein powder, but this one, this is, I've had this pro thing of protein powder for a minute, and um, when I went on Amazon to like restock, they had changed some things. They had changed the, um, they actually put sugar in it, and this one has no sugar. It does have, um, the net carbs is three, because if you subtract the fiber from here, it'll give you three net carbs. Um, that's not what I had a problem with. What I had a problem with was the fact that they had sugar in it. And I don't want nothing. When I'm on this diet, I don't want any sugar in, in anything, really. But um, um, I think I'm going to replace this with another brand called... Um, what is the name of that brand? Um, I can't remember the name. I'll put it somewhere in the video, um, the name of the brand of the protein powder that I'm switching to. But I have this, and I also have... Um, this protein powder that I'm trying to use up, uh, and that brand is called. Let me see if I either have the sheet because I normally keep a lot of stuff around. When I, um, I always keep the little the papers. I might not have it. Put up that Um. Okay. This is a Walmart brand protein powder. And this one literally has, I always keep the little sheets because I, I need to know um, the calorie content and, you know, the sugar content level. If you see, this is a Walmart brand um, protein powder. It's like, um, who is it by? It's called um, Better Body Foods. It does have another name, but I, I cut it. It's, it's, it actually has um, pea protein and quinoa protein powder, right? So... Um, this only has like two carbs in it. it has two carbs and it has no sugar so I'm gonna be when I finish that one that's in the closet I'm gonna in the cabinet I'm gonna switch over to this one use it up and then I'm gonna order my stuff off Amazon now my other protein sources um, for this diet is gonna be um, I'm gonna show you some more before I end this video um, I'm also gonna be consuming almond flour a little bit just a little bit of almond flour because when you introduce a lot of new a lot of things on this diet you tend to stall and I'm not trying to be I'm not in a mood to be on a stall diet so um, let me show you and these are red lentils but these have a lot of carbs in it so I'm not gonna be eating those but I probably will be eating a little bit of green lentils. These have less carbs in it than these. Now, I won't be consuming that much, but just enough, just a, just a little bit. And I also will be consuming, if I'm pronouncing this correctly, you all can just beat me up in the comment section, but quinoa. Um, I'll be eating this too. And I think that those are all my protein sources that I'll be eating during this diet. So... Okay, so that is it. Um, that's all my protein sources for the diet. If you guys have any questions, concerns, comments, whatever, <laughs> leave them down below and subscribe. Peace, and I'm out.